Well, hey folks, I haven't uploaded a YouTube video for a while, so um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a YouTube video and an Instagram live video, not at the same time, so it's going to be two different ones, but uh, I decided for the YouTube one, I'm going to do a new review for special blue whipped cream chargers. So I've done Whip It brand, I've done Nitro, and now I'm doing Special Blue. Now the thing is with these is I got to figure out if it was really worth my money because I did, went to this bodega uh, down in Reno here and uh, the guy, like normally I get a box of like 50 for like $21, $22, you know? Um, and uh, this guy charged me with the two dollar and a half dollars with tax, twenty six ninety nine, so twenty seven dollars, and so it was almost thirty bucks for this box, and I'm like, wow. So I'm trying to find out if this box is really worth that extra money. So uh, without any further ado, I'm going to uh, take this charger. I'm going to load my first one in, and uh, like so. All right. All right. Now, what I like to do is, and I, I've never done this in my 46 years on this planet. I've been doing whippets since I was a teenager, going to dead shows and fish concerts and all that stuff. And, uh, well, I mean, actual nitrous tanks at shows, you guys know. But whippets, when you're at home, normal stoners, you know, just go to the head shop and get fucking whippet chargers. And uh, I've, uh, I, I never thought about this, because usually um, people, when they're doing the canister, they're just like... Me, I'm a balloon huffer. I'm like, if you're going to do it, go for broke, right? So I was really surprised when about a year ago, I was tired of uh, me and my friend. We we're trying to, we we're tired of doing crackers and getting them cold and freezing up. And it's hard to unloosen them. And then I was like, dude, why not fucking stick the fucking balloon? Like on the end and hold it like this. And I'll show you what I mean. And I was like, and ever since then, it's like, that's the how I do it. So I'm still using these things, but I'm not doing it the same way normal people do it. So let's see here. Whoa there. Okay. So let's take that down. Now I did a triple, mind you, because uh, you know, a lot of people like doing doubles. A triple gets me usually two really good ones and then an ass one at the end but by the time the ass one at the end i'm still kind of high off the first two so that's why i like doing triples so i'm going to start this real quick and go get ready got that wah 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 like the the good old the good old days you know like with the reason they call it hippie crack you know because it's like anyone that has actually done crack you know you know that and i'm not advocating crack use to anyone i'm just saying now they call it hippie crack because it's this short real wah 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 you know and it's laughing gas you know <laughs> hey. so you know it's nitrous oxide but it, they use that for the whipped cream chargers and so it's not as good as doing a balloon off a tank but you know hey and what you don't want to do is just so you know 
you know? Don't do racing blends. Like, if you can legally go to air gas or something like that or some gas fucking place and they say, oh, yeah, we got the racing blends, don't do the racing blends. Because if you do that, because you don't need a license to do that. You need a, a medical license to get medical grade nitrous. So don't just go to any air gas and go, well, it's nitrous, no big deal. They put a certain amount of sulfur in racing blends so you to fuck with you so you won't fucking do it. You know, so just anyone know, you can't just go to a gas place and say, hey, give me some fucking uh, racing nitrous and expect to fucking sit here and party on it because it'll fuck you up bad. Um, it's not made for that at all. That was a pretty nice one. It was for round two. So, that's, I, I'm really enjoying that second hit. So, uh, let me tell you, I, I'm, I'm finding out where that little extra money was, was put. I'm not necessarily saying it was worth all that much, but I will so far, now I'll do my asset, so far, give it a thumbs up. Now, the reason you want to go for broke on the ass hit is because you know that it's the ass hit. So, with that, um, I, I like it. Even the ass hit was nice. So, uh, Overall, I'm going to give it a thumbs up, a two thumbs up, a two thumbs up. I'm not necessarily saying it's worth 30 bucks a fucking box, like fucking eight more bucks normal than the other ones. But I will say that it is better than Nitro or Whip It, which I've previously done in my previous videos. So if you've seen any of these, you know, you've seen my Whip It video and you've seen my Nitro video. So... I'm going to cut out from here. So, hey, if you like this video, make sure you ring the bell, subscribe to my channel, and hey, subscribe to Rock and Wrestling Local 420 on Potomatic, and uh, check out my YouTube channel here. Check out my Instagram. Um, you just got to go to uh, Rock and Wrestling Local 420 to find me here on YouTube. But my Instagram is Punching Baby Yoda. So, uh, check me out there. That's where I have the most subscribers so far. That's why I'm trying to beef up the YouTube. So I'm trying to combat these, you know, help them go against, go, go with each other, coincide with each other. So mm. once again, Rock and Wrestling Local 420 podcast, check it out. And, uh, you know, also, you know what, before I forget, check out the I Live the 80s podcast with Ed and Joe. And, uh, you know, they're really killer. And I, and I, do their show every uh, Wednesday at 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern. And uh, tonight, you if you catch this last episode on uh, the cherished memories and stuff like that, concerts and stuff like that, just whatever, 
you'll see the you might see the story of me me and Mr. Google talking about our Paris Dead Show whipping experience. You know, Mr. Google actually ended up with a record because of that. So check out that podcast. Check out that episode. It's the newest episode. Check out my podcast. Ring the bell. Subscribe for all notifications. And I'll see you next time.